If you have ever been anywhere near the coast, you know that seawater is salty. Very salty. But we also know that rivers, ice and rain is not salty. So why are some salty and others aren't? That is the real question here. The truth is, fresh water isn't pure water. It contains all sorts of gubbins including salt. Even rainwater has traces of salt. Most of the gunk in rainwater though is pollution. So as rain falls, which already contains traces of salt, it lands on rocks and soils and passes through it. As it does this, it picks up the minerals. This is known as weathering as it wears down the rocks. This water will then make its own way into streams and rivers and into lakes and oceans. It is reckoned that the dissolved salt levels in the world's rivers today would be equal to what the oceans were 300 million years ago. So I included lakes before with oceans because some lakes are really, really salty, mainly the Dead Sea and the Great Salt Lakes, both of which are 10 times saltier than seawater. This is because, unlike most lakes, they have no outlet rivers. Most lakes have an input and an output, so they're only a temporary storage, but the Dead Sea and the Great Salt Lakes are permanent storage. As the water evaporates, it leaves the salt behind, making it more and more salty each day. But there is another reason why we have salty seas. Features known as hydrothermal vents on the sea floor are where water seeped into the oceanic crust and is being heated up, then explodes out onto the surface in its superheated form. But as the water heats up, it can hold more minerals. As it comes back superheated, it brings a boatload of minerals with it, including a lot of salt. The final process is called submarine volcanism. That's an underwater volcano eruption. This works very similar to a hydrothermal vent where the oceanic basalt, that's the really quickly cooled lava, reacts with the salt water to make it take in even more salt from its surroundings. My question is, will it get any saltier? I don't know, my research suggests no, saying that it's already a steady state, however, I also remember something about where the seafloor is basically just salt and a little bit of water rather than water with a little bit of salt. So what is your opinion? Leave it in the comments below. Also look out for more why videos. Here is a bunch that I've already made. Like and subscribe and I'll be a very happy bunny. Ciao for now.